We know that the compound interest formula is used to calculate compound interest when we take a loan or when we invest money in something. But there are more applications of the compound interest formula. For example, this formula can be used for increase or decrease in population or increase or decrease in the forest cover of a country or of an area. It is also used in the price increase or decrease in the value of an item, say price of a car or price of some machinery or value of your house. And it can also be used in the laboratory to check the increase or decrease in the count of bacteria. It is important to know such applications of compound interest formula because you'll see such things in the compound interest word problems. Let's take an example. The population of a town was 30,000 in the year 2010. It increased at the rate of 8% per annum. Find the population at the end of the year 2013. That means after three years. You can see that the increase in population happens every year. That means every new year has new population. And therefore, the increase in the population is in the compounded form. So this is a good example of application of compound interest formula. What is the formula? A equals P multiplied by 1 plus R over 100 to the power of n. Now look at the problem. You can see that p is 30,000 here and r is 8 and n is 3 because we want to find the population at the end of the year 2013. So 2013 minus 2010 is 3 years. If you substitute all these values in the formula, it looks like this. 30,000 multiplied by 1 plus 8 over 100 to the power of 3. When you solve this, you will get the answer which will be the population at the end of 2013. I am not going to solve this further because this is quite easy. Instead, I am going to solve the next problem which is a little bit different than what we have done before. Here is the next problem. Raj bought a computer at a price of 24,000 rupees. If the value of the computer depreciated by 10% every year, what will be its value after 2 years? What does depreciated mean? Depreciated means reduced due to use or aging. When you use a computer or some other machinery or your car for some time, because of its usage, because of its aging and because it is old, its value reduces. That is called as depreciation. So the value is depreciated here by 10%. What is the original value? 24,000. So in this case, 24,000 is P. N which is the number of years equals 2. And now if you look at this rate, rate is 10%. But in this case, the price is reducing by 10%. In many problems, the principal increases. So when the principal increases, when it goes up, R is positive. When it is reducing, when it goes down, R is negative. So in this case, the rate will be negative 10. Why? Because the price, which is 24,000 here, is going to reduce every year. In other examples where we calculate interest on the principal, the interest gets added to the principal and the value of the principal increases. Here the value is going down, so R is negative. Let's substitute all these values. So we get 24,000 multiplied by 1 plus negative 10 over 100, the whole thing to the power of 2. I have written negative 10 here because the rate should be negative in this case. 1 plus negative 10 over 100 equals 1 minus 10 over 100. So what we have here is 24,000. 1 minus 
टेन ओवर हंड्रेड टू द पावर ऑफ टू वन कैन बी रिटर्न एज हंड्रेड ओवर हंड्रेड सो हंड्रेड ओवर हंड्रेड माइनस टेन ओवर हंड्रेड इक्वल्स नाइन्टी ओवर हंड्रेड सो यू हैव ट्वेंटी फोर थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड बाय नाइन्टी ओवर हंड्रेड मल्टीप्लाइड बाय नाइन्टी ओवर हंड्रेड नाइन्टी ओवर हंड्रेड कैन बी रिटर्न एज नाइन ओवर टेन दैट मीन्स इट इज ट्वेंटी फोर थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड बाय नाइन ओवर टेन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय नाइन ओवर टेन लेट्स कैंसल आउट टू जीरोज फ्रॉम द न्यूमरेटर एंड टू फ्रॉम द डिनोमिनेटर कैंसलिंग आउट जीरोज मीन्स एक्चुअली आई एम डिवाइडिंग द न्यूमरेटर एज वेल एज द डिनोमिनेटर बाय हंड्रेड सो नाउ वी हैव टू फोर्टी मल्टीप्लाइड बाय नाइन नाइन जर एटी वन सो टू फोर्टी मल्टीप्लाइड बाय एटी वन टू मल्टीप्लाई दिस वी नीड टू मल्टीप्लाई एटी वन बाय ट्वेंटी फोर एंड वॉट एवर आंसर वी गेट वी पुट एक्स्ट्रा जीरो आफ्टर दैट सो इफ यू डू द मल्टीप्लीकेशन यू गेट नाइनटीन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी दैट मीन्स द वैल्यू ऑफ द कंप्यूटर आफ्टर टू ईयर्स विल बी नाइनटीन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी रुपीज दिस इज द आंसर बट इज दिस राइट आई शेल बी वेरीफाइड सिंस वी यूज द निगेटिव रेट लेट्स जस्ट वेरीफाई दिस बाय अनदर मेथड द करंट वैल्यू ऑफ द कंप्यूटर इज ट्वेंटी फोर थाउजेंड आफ्टर वन ईयर इट विल ड्रॉप बाय टेन परसेंट टेन परसेंट ऑफ ट्वेंटी फोर थाउजेंड इक्वल्स टू थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड That means the value after one year will be twenty-four thousand minus two thousand four hundred equals twenty-one thousand six hundred. Twenty-four thousand minus two thousand is twenty-two thousand, and if you subtract four hundred from twenty-two thousand, you get twenty-one thousand six hundred. For the second year, it will again get reduced by ten percent. This ten percent will be ten percent of twenty-one thousand six hundred. So ten percent of twenty one six hundred equals two thousand one sixty. Now let's subtract two thousand one sixty from twenty one thousand six hundred. And when you do this subtraction, you get nineteen thousand four hundred and forty. So we got the same answer. That means now we are really sure that if there is any reduction of price, or if there is decrease in the population. or decrease in the plantation for any such problem r should be negative